It's been a long road. I was trained as an architect and have been a real estate developer for the last many years. And I built this building in 2005. It was a long process to get it approved through the city and whatnot. But when I was about to get the certificate of occupancy, I walked around the building. And at the time, Highcroft Racing had six employees. And uh, the remainder of the building was unleased two weeks before we opened. So I thought, you know, what the hell have I done here? I've got this huge building and how the hell am I gonna fill it up? And, and uh, two weeks later, I'm happy to say, we opened up fully leased and 100% uh, occupied. And with a very short period of time, we went from six employees to 26 employees. And obviously have progressed from running our own sort of fledgling uh, ALMS team as a privateer to being a fully backed factory supported uh, sponsored by perhaps the best uh, sponsor in the paddock, uh, LMP1 champion, um, just this past uh, October. So it's been a long road as far as the amount of work and effort that's gone into it, but a relatively short period of time uh, on the calendar. And, and uh, I'm just tremendously proud of the people and the effort that's gone into those accomplishments in this building. So it's been, it's been a hell of a ride. Well, ra racing is really a team sport. Um, in many cases, the focus um, in, on, in the media is on the drivers, but it is such a team sport. It takes an incredible team of people to put these cars on the racetrack, race in and race out, have them be reliable, not just for short races, but for uh, endurance races that go as long as 24 hours. So to have the best and brightest in our team at all levels is a critical component to success. This year, because of our success, we've been able to add to our team, adding uh, two terrific drivers to our driver lineup to join David Brabham, Simon Pagino, who came to us from DeFerrin Motorsports, and Marino Franchitti, who came to us from Dyson. Uh, those are two terrific driver uh, additions. It's going to be a very formidable team of drivers, and that gives us just additional weaponry to use in our com competition for the championship once again in 2010. We also have added Will Phillips as a senior engineer and our engineering director. Uh, Will is an incredibly talented individual. Uh, we had been seeking to attract Will to join Highcroft uh, several years ago, and we finally had the opportunity to attract Will to come join us. Uh, adding depth in our engineering capabilities in-house, adding experience, uh, and adding complementing skill sets amongst all our engineers really builds the deepest team we can have. And as I mentioned before, w this is a giant engineering project. Uh, the engineers really are what design these fabulous machines, keep them running, make them faster, make them better, make them safer. Um, and we don't underestimate any of those things.